A man dies after crashing his motorcycle into a garage near 99th and Bedford in the middle of the afternoon. But police say they didn't learn about it till an hour, at least an hour later, when someone coming home from work found the body. KETV News Watch Center's Nicole Goodrich is live at the latest. Nicole? Jeremy, police say Hector Jimenez Jr. likely died instantly. They believe that his inexperience and speed were factors in the crash. Now the accident has neighbors pleading with motorcyclists to slow down in the area. A motorcycle's last path is painted on the ground. Around this corner on Bedford Avenue, then off the road through several yards, the markings lead straight to this garage door. Neighbors heard what they thought was a motorcycle revving at a high rate of speed um, shortly before a loud bang, but when residents and citizens looked out, they didn't see anyone. When emergency crews showed up, they declared Hector Jimenez Jr. dead at the scene. Officers say he wasn't experienced, and that likely contributed to the crash. He didn't have a motorcycle endorsement, so we don't know how much training he actually had. Neighbors tell us the sound of motorcycles speeding down the street isn't uncommon. William Fowler lives next door and got home shortly after first responders arrived. I just wanted to make sure my granddaughter didn't, didn't see it and stuff. But the sight he saw left him with the message, slow down. Hopefully it'll spur any of these guys on motorcycles to slow down and not to be speeding because if they would have been here and seen the body laying and stuff, it would have been a complete shock to them. Police say Jimenez was wearing a helmet. They're waiting for an autopsy to be conducted. Back to you.